It's a violent force that you want to avoid at all costs. Storm surge, basically water piling up inside and ahead of the hurricane that eventually gets slammed onto shore. In this ABC News virtual view, we can see that in the center of the hurricane, as pressure falls, water levels rise. All that water piling up while it's still over the open ocean. As a hurricane closes in on land, the strong winds push that water toward the coast, and it has nowhere left to go but up and inland. This is what it might look like inside a home taking on storm surge. The water approaching quickly and viciously, entering your home and quickly climbing. And when storm surge combines with high tide, the rapid rise in water can actually move a home. Something I watched with my own eyes in Hurricane Michael in 2018. I just saw something I have never seen in real life. I saw an entire home taken off of its foundation and rolled down the street. Another critical reason you might want to leave? The wind. Just this summer, the Insurance Institute for Business and Home Safety showing GMA its hurricane simulator and what it can do to a home when it's dialed up to a Cat 3. 125 mile per hour winds. Chunks of the roof ripped off. The ceiling collapsing. Exposing the home and anyone inside to the full wrath of the storm. That dangerous wind, not just obliterating the roof. This two by four cannon reminding us what deadly flying debris can do when it's launched by a hurricane. Piercing through the window, the bed, the wall, and even the couch on the other side. With windows so vulnerable in a hurricane, experts shared this advice. As you leave, close all interior doors. It can help contain the wind to just that part of the house and limit damage. With storm surge, just a mile or two can make all the difference in the world. And guys, you know I do that, that show, Hearts of Heroes. We have so many stories about first responders that have risked their own lives in storms like this. If for anyone else, do it for them and get out before the storm comes. Oh, boy. Uh, that simulation just showed you just how dangerous it is. Ginger, thank you for sharing that with us.